The Fags Pa script Mongolian, square script is an alphabet designed by the Tibetan monk and state preceptor later imperial preceptor Drogon Chogyal Phagpa for Kublai Khan, the founder of the Yuan dynasty, as a unified script for the written languages within the Yuan. The actual use of this script was limited to about a hundred years during the Mongol Yuan dynasty, and it fell out of use with the advent of the Ming dynasty. The documentation of its use provides clues about the changes in the varieties of Chinese, the Tibetic languages, Mongolian and other neighboring languages during the Yuan era. History The Uyghur-based Mongolian alphabet is not a perfect fit for the Middle Mongol language, and it would be impractical to extend it to a language with a very different phonology like Chinese. Therefore, during the Yuan dynasty circa 1269, Kublai Khan asked Fags Pa to design a new alphabet for use by the whole empire. Fags Pa extended his native Tibetan alphabet, one of the Brahmic scripts, to encompass Mongol and Chinese, evidently Central Plains Mandarin. The resulting 38 letters have been known by several descriptive names, such as square script, based on their shape, but today are primarily known as the Fags Pa alphabet. Despite its origin, the script was written vertically top to bottom like the previous Mongolian scripts. It did not receive wide acceptance, and was not a popular script even among the elite Mongols themselves, although it was used as an official script of the Yuan dynasty until the early 1350s when the Red Turban Rebellion started. After this it was mainly used as a phonetic gloss for Mongolians learning Chinese characters. It was also used as one of the scripts on Tibetan currency in the 20th century, as script for Tibetan seal inscriptions from the Middle Ages up to the 20th century and for inscriptions on the entrance doors of Tibetan monasteries. <laughs> Forms Unlike the ancestral Tibetan script, all Fags Pa letters are written in temporal order that is, CV, is written in the order CV for all vowels and inline that is, the vowels are not diacritics. However, vowel letters retain distinct initial forms, and short, A, is not written except initially, making Fags Pa transitional between an abugida and a full alphabet. The letters of a Fags Pa syllable are linked together so that they form syllabic blocks. Fags Pa was written in a variety of graphic forms. The standard form top, at right, was blocky, but a Tibetan form bottom was even more so, consisting almost entirely of straight orthogonal lines and right angles. A seal script form Chinese men gu zhuanzi mungu zhuanzi, Mongolian seal script, used for imperial seals and the like, was more elaborate, with squared sinusoidal lines and spirals. Korean records state that Hangul was based on an old seal script, Gu Zhuan Zi, which Gary Ledyard believes to be Fags Pa and a reference to its Chinese name, Men Gu Zhuan Zi. Mungu Zhuan Zi, see Origin of Hangul. However, it is the simpler standard form of Fags Pa that is the closer graphic match to Hangul. <laughs> Letters Following are the initials of the Fags Pa script as presented in the Mungu Zian. They are ordered according to the Chinese philological tradition of the 36 initials. <laughs> Unicode Fags Pa script was added to the Unicode standard in July 2006 with the release of version 5.0. The Unicode block for Fags Pa is U plus A 840 U plus A 877 U plus A 856, PHAGS PA letter small a is transliterated using U plus A 78 F Latin letter SINOLOGICAL dot from the Latin extended D Unicode block. See also Brahmic scripts Mongolian alphabets Origin of Hangul Mongol elements in Western medieval art Mungu Zian Yuan Dynasty Fags Pa Chinese rhyming dictionary Stephen Wooten Bushel <laughs>